Hello, my name is Alex from the Advent Label Applicator Company. And this is going to be a demonstration of an Advent 300, our standard pressure sensitive labeler, labeling these on one gallon ABS type containers um, with an ear. Now we're actually not putting a die cut um, label over the ears. We're actually just positioning it between the ears. And we have a 300 with an optional registration system here that's registering off the ear. And let me just go ahead and demonstrate it really quickly so you can just see how it works. So you can see it's feeding a single label and based on the registration when it hits this ear we're able to control exactly where this label goes along the circumference of the um, one gallon container. And what we're doing is we're just simply aiming it between the two ears. And that's fully adjustable by adjusting this um, locking timer right here. So we could get that aimed anywhere along the circumference. And as you can see here, it's as simple as just enabling the registration system. And you'll see this label will go on within about a sixteenth of an inch each and every time. As you can see here. So it's going to be very, very accurate. And generally our concern with pressure sensitive labels is how they're going to lay up on a surface like this. And you can see here it's absolutely perfect. Um, we have a, um, a larger peel bar here and we're wiping it on here with a lot of pressure to get that to lay up really nicely without any bubbles or wrinkles. So let me go ahead and demonstrate the final three. Again, we have two modes. Mode one would turn off the ear registration, so we'll just put the label anywhere along the circumference. But in mode two, we turn on the registration system, and that allows us to aim the label. You can see here. Really nice job, all three of them. Again, no wrinkles, no bubbles. Looks absolutely fantastic. Now, what's really neat about the registration system, and we have experience with this because uh, we work with five gallon pails, um, is our ability to do a back label. You kind of get that capability built into the machine. And how that works is you just need to register off the other ear, the ear that's opposite. And you can simply remember that by facing the label down. And if you do that, oops, I'm sorry, that was my mistake. I'm in mode one, so that's not with the registration. That's feeding a label on. And you can see here, it's just putting a label on right away. Still does a really nice job. Let me correct it to mode two. And then you'll see that the label will be opposite 180 degrees. As you can see there. And that's really a really nice way of getting a front back label onto a container. And generally that's a pretty um, demanding application, but you're able to do that on an Advent 300 with the registration system. So that, that's a really nice feature if it is something you're interested in. And let me just go ahead and um, demonstrate that. We'll just do it to the other two containers. that. You can see here, really straightforward. Make sure it's facing down. And there you go. And even with the registration system, if you're just putting a single label on, I imagine you should be able to average at least 20 containers a minute. You can see the label goes on within about a second. It really comes down to the issue of the operator just inserting and taking it out as um, quickly as they can. So essentially the staging of the product. So that's the 300. If there's any questions, we can reach at 800-846-7716. Thank you.